We're here tonight so James can live out one of his unfulfilled sexual fantasies. <laughs> Has Go a get it back. Directing partner named Evan Goldberg. What does this other guy look like that you're the face of the operation? <laughs> I assume he's like a sweaty Orthodox Jew eating a pastrami sandwich. Hey, Shetty, yeah, I added nine dick jokes on page four. And I was thinking that you guys are friends, and then they're not friends, and then at the end of the movie, they're friends again. <laughs> And also, they should smoke a lot of guns, you says he. Lisa Lampanelli's here. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Jeff Ross. Jeff is holding it. Hill, you know, a lot of people are gonna touch on your weight tonight, Jonah, but not enough people are gonna talk about what an asshole you've become. Quick reminder that if at any point tonight James fully opens his eyes, there will Head be six more weeks now. of summer. Sarah Silverman, everyone's like, she's hot for a comic. But I don't agree, because she's not just hot for a comic, she's hot for someone her age. That's right. Um, seriously, Sarah, you were my favorite comic as a kid. Um, and then there's, uh, there's Jeff Ross, who's gonna fucking kill me later. Um, I never gave you this compliment before, but you're actually the reason I decided to become successful. I saw what you became, and it scared the living shit out of me. But seriously, guys, can you please pick up after yourselves? It's gonna make Jeff's life a lot easier. Aziz, uh, Natasha, Nick Kroll, um, I'm assuming you guys are James's friends from high school, but I think that is so dope that you guys are willing to get up here even though no one knows who the fuck you guys are. Can't tell if this is the dais or the line to sub Judd advertise the ball. <laughs> right before the show started, the Seth rolled on. a gigantic fatty because that was the only way we could get Jonah Hill onto the stage. Jonah actually gained 50 pounds for his role in the new Martin Scorsese <laughs> film because the producers wanted the character to be a Jonah Hill type. We are very excited, and I'm just going to say it, honored to introduce our Cash is moving. He's responsible Advise not just you for move my to the career, safe zone now. for every single person's career in this entire room. You've made it Ladies to the top and gentlemen, five. please Good welcome work. the president of Hollywood. Before I start, I just want to say to everyone up here, you're welcome. In no other place but Hollywood could these 10 people make the kind of money they make and sleep with the kind of people they sleep with. <laughs> Seth Rogen, I put you on a movie poster and I said, deal with it. Gas is in time. Move to the safe zone. And then I put Bob Streisand on that poster and the world said, no. <laughs> Listen, if I wanted to watch two ugly Jews weaving through traffic, I'd watch Seinfeld's web series. And Jonah, I'm assuming you're here because Why Seth the cluster is. Mine? People call me all the time and they say, Hollywood, do we really need Dropping two of some these armor. guys? <laughs> Jeff Ross, hi, I'm Hollywood, we haven't met before. <laughs> Uh, sorry, I haven't been able to do anything yet. An enemy like squad is rental you. car on Christmas Taylor. Day. I do not have a vehicle for you. Now I come to you, James Franco. You're losing right. Has it always been Advice easy you for you, to James? The zone now. You overcame a crippling childhood affliction known as dumb face. But you never let that interfere with your dream of making dog shit movies. I just don't know what you're doing. I gave you a chance to be a movie star, make money, hang out with the spider guy. And you said, nah, I want to be an artist. Well, I'll tell you what I told Richard Grieco 20 years ago. <laughs> play ball, you squinty fuck. Jonah Hill, Let's I loved ball. you as a baseball analyst. I loved you as a baseball analyst in real life. Oh, you Hollywood. And you can tell he's a name dropper with big tits and an eating disorder. Andy's comedy group is called The Lonely Island, which is how each of his teeth. <laughs> Nick Kroll! Your fan must be so excited to hear! No, Nick, I love Kroll show. You are amazing at characters. You're like a chameleon in that you have hideous skin and bulging eyes. Sarah Silverman's had more ugly men inside her than Comic Con. Kim Kardashian is here. Oh, that's a Z, sorry. I get him confused. They're both brown narcissists riding Kanye's dick. <laughs> James Franco. Acting, teaching, directing, writing, producing, photography, soundtracks, editing. Is there anything you can do? Well, at first, I wasn't sure why James would do this roast, and then I thought. Finally, something 